these days one can actually find books uh, which tell you how to uh, get rid of math anxiety. So when books start getting written on the topic, uh, obviously the problem is reaching uh, epidemic levels. So the question that uh, is rather intriguing is the following. Uh, you know, is there a particular age when children start dropping off uh, from, from maths? And whenever I've asked this question to adults, uh, usually they reflect on their own personal experiences and the answers come roughly between ages 10 and 13. Uh, but actually a lot of research has shown that the particular age, uh, plus minus a little bit, uh, when children start dropping off from mathematics, turns out to be age 11. And this actually happens for two reasons. Number one is that the math teaching and learning uh, that happens in the first uh, five years, uh, that is roughly ages 6 to 10, um, a lot of it happens in a manner that math is treated as a computational tool as opposed to a subject which has uh, distinct concepts and each of those concepts have a certain underlying structure to them. And so whenever uh, children find something slightly difficult to absorb, to understand, uh, they end up resorting to memorization. So then they pick up this habit of memorizing things that they don't fully understand or don't fully appreciate. And come age 11, roughly, uh, you're usually met with more sophisticated concepts uh, like algebra. So whenever algebra comes up, you know, with these sort of really infamous X, uh, which shows up uh, in your textbook, children usually freak out and say, look, hang on, I, that, that's, I'm used to numbers and now where did this X come from? So when both of these come together, yeah, you know, it, it really acts as the single point when children start dropping off uh, from, from math. Uh, they spend four to five years uh, either treating math as a computational tool uh, and or if they don't understand anything, memorizing it. And that trick of memorization just simply doesn't work beyond a certain level. And usually it's age 11 uh, when kids start dropping off. So what's the solution? Unfortunately, there isn't an easy solution. The only way to, uh, uh, to, to try and get to the root of this is to try and uh, address both the teaching and the learning of math concepts in the early years, in particular uh, the first five years of, uh, of your math education.